Hello people, my name is Dennis and today I'm going to show you how to build student attendance database using Microsoft Access and as you can see I already have mine built already I'm going to show you how this was built as you can see I have the student ID um, date, first name, last name, status and the points and as you can see if you have absent you get zero points if you have present you get one point so this is how it works so let's input another Dennis Dennis again and present get one point and I save this table close or go to the report now we have Dennis tennis for three points here and my percent rate is 2.5 which is over here one two three I have all these points so if I go back to present and choose date save close all now I have four points as you can see and the other student Eric Doe has one point James Brown has zero points let's give James Brown present guess what is going to happen Eric Doe, James Brown, since they all have total points the same, they get percentage rate the same too. And still, Dennis Stennis is leading with 3.33 percentage rate in attendance. So, this is how this was built. Go to design view. Okay close or open go to design view and I have um student ID as auto number which it keeps going up as I input um any student in and I have the date, which is a date time, data type, first name, last name, status is a lookup value, which I want, I will type in the value, the values I want, which I did type present and absent. and limit to list and finish and this is the points that's where the fun begins this is a calculated field and here is the formula or the expression I told this function that if the status which is present or absent is equal to present put one if it's not then zero let me try to delay this and you will see this see the expression has an expression which is the status and this is 
if this status is true is equal to present then it's true which is equal to 1 if the expression is not equal to present which is false then it's equal to 0 that's how it is the simplest this can be explained and if you use it you're gonna know how to make sense out of it so click OK and the database is ready for use say yes and I went ahead and create a report design which brought my tables here and I exported this delay bring all of this in here and add a salt and grouping and the last name heard it appeared here that's where bring this first name last name delete all uh, this I brought this points right here 